Hello students, my name is Santosh Kumar. I am the course instructor for machining sciences and tool design. We are discussing module number one that is metal cutting theory and ergonometry. In this video we will discuss about modified model for orthogonal cutting. So in the previous video we discussed about the Ernst and Merchant theory. So they reduced a relationship called phi is equal to pi by 4 minus tau by 2 plus alpha by 2. So this is the equation which is uh, deduced by Ernst and Merchant theory. Uh, but uh, it is found that it is this equation is agreeing well within well for the synthetic plastics and it is uh, poorly agreeing with the steel machine with sintered carbide tool. This is the disadvantages of the Ernst and Merchant theory. So they come up with a new theory that is they came up with a second theory. So in this uh, why this above equation was uh, not agreeing with the experiment results of steel machining is because uh, in that assumption was made like AC that is a uh, chip area and uh, rake angle and free angle of friction would be independent of phi. So that is why there it was not agreeing with the steel machining. So on reconsidering these assumptions uh, merchant deduced to include in a new theory the relationships. So they reconsidered the assumptions which is made uh, uh, in the first theory. So they come up with a new theory. So in that they stated that tau will be equal to tau naught plus k sigma s that is tau will be equal to initial shear stress plus k times normal stress that is on a shear plane. So which indicates that shear strength of the material tau increases linearly with increase in normal stress on a shear plane. So if uh, sigma s uh, term is 0, if this term is 0, then tau will be equal to tau naught. So this can be represented by the sketch. Yeah, this is the one representation of that equation. So where uh, if uh, sigma s is 0, that is uh, direct stress is 0 on shear plane, then tau s will be equal to tau s naught. So it will start from here and then it is varying linearly as the sigma s is varying. Okay, and the k is the slope of this line. So by merchant circle, we know that uh, this is the one of the triangle which I am considering out of merchant circle. Fn uh, that is uh, backup force will be equal to r sin phi plus tau minus alpha. So that is uh, using this triangle itself you can uh, get this equation and uh, fn is will be equal to sigma s as this we have uh, got and we have discussed earlier in the previous videos. So instead of as we I can write it as uh, ac by sin phi. So sigma s ac by sin phi. So by rearranging this equation uh, that is I uh, will be sending sin phi on to the left hand side. So it will become sigma s will be, will be equal to fn sin phi by ac. So I will plug in this fn value into this equation. So I will be getting r sin phi plus tau minus alpha by ac into sin phi. So I will call this equation as equation number 1 that is for direct stress. But by Ernst and Merchant theory, we have a R value that is resultant force will be equal to tau s ac by sin phi into 1 by cos phi plus tau minus alpha. This we have uh, got by the Ernst and Merchant theory that is resultant force equation. And then uh, we know that I will be substituting this R value into equation number 1. So sigma s value will become tau s ac by sin phi into ac into e sin phi plus tau minus alpha by cos phi plus tau minus alpha into sin phi. So I have, re I have substituted this r value into equation 1, I have got this value. So now ac, ac gets cancelled, sin phi, sin phi gets cancelled. So this term will become tan because sin by cos is tan. So sigma s will be equal to tau s tan phi plus tau minus alpha. Now by rearranging, uh, tau s will be equal to sigma s into 1 by tan phi plus tau minus alpha. So 1 by tan is cot. So I can write sigma s is tau s will be equal to sigma x sigma s cot 
phi plus tau minus alpha which is equal to tau s naught plus k sigma s that is the equation which uh, new theory has given you uh, tau s minus k sigma x that is I, if I send this on to left hand side so I will be getting tau s minus k sigma x will be equal to tau s naught now I will use the same equation here that is uh, tau s minus k sigma x sigma s is equal to tau s naught so instead of sigma x I will substitute uh, this value I will plug in this value into this equation so I will get uh, tau s minus k tau s tan phi plus tau minus alpha is equal to tau s naught so if I take tau s as a common so it will become 1 minus k tan phi plus tau minus alpha into tau s naught so I rearrange this equation so that I will get I will send this on to the right hand side so it will be in denominator so I will get uh, tau s will be equal to tau s naught by 1 minus k tan phi plus tau minus alpha but uh, we know fc uh, is this is by uh, first theory we know what is fc fc value is tau s ac by sin phi into cos tau minus alpha by cos phi plus tau minus alpha this is we have got by first theory so we will plug in this value that is uh, tau s value into this equation so i will get up i will be getting fc uh, new equation for fc that is fc will be equal to tau s naught ac by sin phi cos tau minus alpha by cos phi plus tau minus alpha into 1 by 1 minus k phi plus tau minus alpha so we know that uh, work done is fc into vc that is uh, four cutting force into velocity so again if we differentiate uh, with respect to phi so we get uh, the minimum work done so i'll use this equation again and differentiate with respect to phi so that I get a new value of phi so it is assumed that k and uh, gamma that is uh, k constant k and uh, rake angle are constant for particular work material and uh, chip area and uh, rake angle are constants for cutting operation so if I will be ending up with a phi value that is 2 phi plus uh, tau minus alpha will be equal to c so this is the new equation of phi which uh, the modified uh, theory of uh, for orthogonal cutting will give you that is this is the uh, uh, Ernst Merchant second theory so in this uh, where C is a uh, given by our code K and uh, is a constant for the work material the C is a constant for a work material so this is the new equation uh, by a modified uh, or theory of orthogonal cutting and this is also called as a Ernst Merchant second theory so we'll end this video